Hey guys, so the first step into a Kiran and Chipka transformation is having her blonde hair. I already have blonde hair, but I do need to update my roots, so I am using the Garnier Nutrice Nourishing Color Cream in the shade 70 Dark Natural Blonde. Nutrice gives a rich, radiant, long-lasting color with 100% great coverage, and the Nourishing Conditioner, which contains avocado, olive, and chia oils, give you soft, radiant hair. The non-drip formula, which smells so good, makes it easy to apply in your hair. Just be sure to follow the instructions on the box, and also keep in mind of the side of the box, which predetermines how your natural hair color will react to the dye. So the box comes with a full kit including the developer, conditioner, color cream, oil concentrate, and most importantly, instructions. So first grab your developer and fill it with the color cream and also the oil concentrate. Put on your gloves and shake the bottle till the formula is mixed, and then just apply it where it's desired. Once you are done, wait around 20 minutes before washing it out. So here is my hair after. Moving on to the makeup, fill in your eyebrows with any brown eyebrow powder. I'm going for a generic thick brow look right now, which I'll be customizing once I see the rest of the eye makeup. Next, let's move on to the eyes. We are going to replicate the look of the downturned eye shape. Grab an orangey nude eyeshadow and dust that into your crease and drag it up to your brow bone as a base. Next, grab a shimmery medium brown eyeshadow and dust it into your crease to darken the base. Then, use a shimmery chocolate brown to apply it on the outer half of your eye and top the lid off with a shimmery champagne eyeshadow. All of the eyeshadows are shimmery because Kiernan seems to often sport a very dewy and soft makeup look. Now grabbing the chocolate brown again, apply it with a wet eyeliner brush into your upper lash line. And then drag it down past your lash line, forming a V at the end of your eye, and blend that into your lower lash line. This is really the key to getting the downturned eye shape. Next, curl and apply mascara to your top and bottom lashes to open up the eye. Then grab a white eyeliner pencil and fill in your lower lash line. This will not only open up and brighten the eye, but it will also enhance the downturned effect. Moving on to the face, apply foundation and then a bright concealer under your eyes leading down to your cheek, also on your chin and on your forehead, and blend that all in. Before moving on to the next step, be sure to set your face with setting powder. Next, take a coral pink blush and lightly dust it all over your cheek, and also add it around your forehead for a naturally flush look. Now apply highlighter to the highest points of your cheekbones to complete the dewy look. For the lips, any natural pink or a Sabrina red will do, and I'm applying it like I usually do since we have a similar lip shape already. Now for the nose, apply blush around and a bit on the tip of your nose as if you were out in the cold weather and contour your jawline a bit higher than usual to give the illusion of a higher jaw.
Lastly, apply a drop of tan foundation onto a spoolie to brush into your eyebrows until they lighten up to a moussey brown, and also until they blend out into a more natural shape since Kiernan's eyebrows aren't perfectly drawn in. And here is the finished look! So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a witchy thumbs up. If you guys have any awesome suggestions on who I should transform into next, comment them down below and subscribe so I can see you in my next video.